Yo, what's going on guys? I'm Top Boy 1000 and this is Honest Rail Reviews. There's no bullshitting at all. I'm not sponsored by anybody. Not really trying to be sponsored because they're going to try to give me some free products and then lie to y'all. And that's not really what I'm about. I'd rather buy it, try it, and either approve it or I'm going to fucking trash it. So, if you've been following me for a minute, you know I've been on the FK Iron Wave. So, the Flux Max, I put out a video which was right here, it's uh, don't buy a FK Irons Flux Max until you watch this. So I got about 12,000 people that watched that video. So this is kind of a follow up. I'm gonna do an unboxing so y'all can see what I'm unboxing. But what's cool about this video is I have the clone here, the FK Max clone. So I found this on Amazon. For some reason the link ain't working right now, so I don't know if they knocked it off or what. But I wanted to open these boxes up, compare them. Then I'll do another video later on next week. And I'll actually be using both of these on a portrait. So we'll see how they are while I'm using them. Um, and like I said, I wasn't putting out content because we were doing construction on the shop. But now I got a whole film room just for content. So we're going to be pumping out content. Anything y'all can think of that we can try, we can buy it. We're going to be doing things. We're going to do needle reviews, ink reviews fake skin reviews. I'm even gonna do a couple how-tos, but let's start off with this one. So right now, this is the FK Irons Flux Max. I think I paid a little bit over 1100 for it. So let's see what comes in this one first. Nice little box with the magnet on it. That's all, that's all you get is just a little box. And inside the box, all you're getting is the machine. One, one battery. You don't even get two batteries. Starts right up. Uh, take the box out. They got empty cot spots in the box again. So we got an extra spot where you can buy the extra battery. I think it costs us like 13, 14 on it with the extra battery. We got a little charging wire. And that's it. You don't even get an RCA adapter. And like I spoke about in my last video, this ratchet system still sucks. Still trash. It's so loose and so flimsy. Don't move when you're tatting really, to be honest. But I also have this whole thing wrapped up, so that might help some. But um, still not happy with the ratchet system. It's just a little piece of plastic inside here. This little plastic piece. So that's about all you get on that one. The box is numbered. Your power bolt's numbered. It says Flux Max. Has the FKI and logo on it. So let's get into the clone. Found this on Amazon. Was uh 640 with shipping. So still a little pricey for a clone. But same style box, but no logo on it. Probably so they don't get sued. Now when you open this one up, as you can see, you're getting a double battery pack. And they give you an RCA adapter in case your batteries die. With two of them, probably won't happen. But hey, if it ever did, you have an emergency. You don't get that with FK Irons cheap ass that wants to give you barely anything in the box for top dollar. So right off the back, the one thing I noticed about the clone, this is more of a brass color. The part that says Max on it. But you hear that? Oh my God. The clone has a real ratchet system. The company that actually makes this machine, FK Irons, still won't give you a real ratchet, which I can't understand why they go so cheap. Trying, trying to make millions of dollars off these, I guess. But um, so we'll pull it apart, we'll open it up. Yup, ball bearings. And that is the difference. I love it. That I love. Um, battery packs about the same weight. This top piece is a little heavier than the original and it's, it's a little bit longer, maybe a half of an inch longer dynamic this way, but nothing bad. Weighs a little bit heavier. When I do the, uh, video where I'm using them, I'll bring a scale and I'll weigh both of them. I didn't have a scale with me right now, but honestly, I'm fucking with this machine right here. I actually like the weight. Because when I pull my lines, 
that little extra weight is going to help a lot. These are both, um, this one's a four stroke. This one's a 3.2. So we're going to have a little bit of comparison going on with that, obviously, when I run them. So in the box, two, two uh, power bolts, both nice clear screens. And to be honest, this LCD screen is clearer than the original, brighter and clearer. In the box, you get the charging wire also. And watch this, they give you extra rings. Like, come on, FK Hines, are you fucking kidding me? You guys don't give shit. I don't, I don't understand it for the price. Like, I, I'm not gonna knock FK Irons. I really like the machine, and I've been rocking with them for a while, but they're so cheap. And I don't know if the customer service is getting better, but it's been ass every time I've dealt with them. Got some nice instructions in here about the power bolt, about the machine. So overall, I haven't ran the machine. This thing runs smooth. A lot like the original. Can't wait to rock this out and make this next video for you guys. Let's see if I can get a close up of the screen. See how nice and clear that is? It's fucking beautiful. Now, watch, I'm gonna take the original back out so we can do some comparisons. All right. So now we've got both of them out, right? Here's our comparisons. See these? So the the bolt is about the same, the, the power bolt is about the same size, side by side. This is nice and gold on the original. So that's where you can see this is a copper color. They say it's gold. If that's gold, shit. They definitely sound fake gold. But this is gold. This is copper. Copper is the clone. Gold's original. Um, if you look at this, let's see, yeah, you can see right there that the clone is a little bit longer, giving it a little more weight. It's nothing crazy. I really want to weigh these for you and show you that, but here's, here's my, here's my big problem with this. Let's see if I can get somehow to zoom in on both. Can you see how much better? The clone screen, which is this one, is then the original. Let's see if I can get just the original in there. It's blurry, it's choppy. Some of the stuff's actually hard to read. And this one is so clear and clean. And again, this thing is so loose. That right there, I'm sold. Now, is the machine gonna work the same? I don't know it's not because this is a 3.2 and this is a 4.0. But I guarantee I'll still pull a portrait off with it. But we'll do some comparisons. We're gonna run some lines with these. We're gonna do some shading with these. And I wanna know, can the clone match the original? Is the clone gonna come back to Amazon? That I'm curious about. If you have the clone, comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you stop real quick. Let's take a break. Let's get everybody to hit that subscribe. Please hit subscribe. Try to help me get to a thousand followers. Once I hit a thousand subscribers, I'm definitely gonna be out here starting to give stuff away because I feel like I'm not trying to do giveaways to gas people up to follow me. Don't follow me if you just want free stuff. But if you're following me and you want content, I'm gonna do it. And you gotta think I'm gonna be buying stuff that I'm not gonna keep. So half of it, I'm just gonna raffle it off somehow, some random way. But as of right now, that's what I feel about these two machines. I'm liking the weight of the clone better than the original. I'm loving the LCD screen better on the clone than the original. And the ratchet system. I'm loving that. Like you, you can't get out of that click. Like that'll never slip. Oop, my needle's out a little further than, than it was five minutes ago. This, it, it, it can happen. It's happened to me. It doesn't happen much. But it can happen. This thing's just, it's just loose and flimsy. But other than that, 
know what I mean? Box is uh, pretty much the same. You know, you this is the clone box. This is the original. The original only thing you got a lot different in it is you got your QR code and you got the FKI and badges and serial numbers and stuff like that to make it official. Plus, it's made in the USA, from what I understand right here. Engine and made in the USA. Do they buy parts from China? I would think so, but who knows? I don't want to say that they do. FKINs, if you're watching, you should comment below. Do you buy parts in China? And then, this is the regular box from the clone. There's no labeling on it other than saying Max. And obviously, that's for lawsuit purposes and stuff like that. It is a four stroke. I don't know if you guys can see this. Yep, right there, four stroke. So, like I said, original, all you're getting if you buy the regular without buying the extra power bowl and spending an extra couple hundred bucks for about 1200 with shipping and everything, you're gonna get this machine right here. And you're only gonna get one power bolt with it. I did try to take the power bolt off of that and use the clone one, but it doesn't fit. So you can't use the clones inside of this. Vice versa, I can't use the clone into the, um, I mean the original into the clone machine. So again, you get all this, I got all this for 640. So I got the RCA adapter, two power bolts and machine for 640. And yeah, if you guys stay tuned in, make sure you subscribe. And um, if you want me to do any other content, I won't be slacking no more. I can't wait to show you guys this video of the shop. I'm gonna make a little video this week. I'm gonna put it on here on YouTube so you guys can see the shop. We got an L game room now pool table, arcade games. We got 10 tattoo rooms. We got this big private event room. You'll be able to see all of this. Um, we will, I will be doing some how-tos, aftercare, a whole bunch of product reviews now that I have the space to do it in. And let me know what you guys been thinking about the Flux Max. And if you ever use the clone, let me know what you guys think about that. Stay tuned for more content. I should be, by next week, I'll have the other video dropping of me using these doing a portrait so i really be live timing um how they run how they feel and what i really think because right now i'm wavering towards the clone but again won't know until i run it because this is an amazing machine the uh, flux max original i just got a couple pet peeves the lcd screen sucks the ratchet system sucks battery dies a little faster than i would want to so I'll be comparing all that. Nice full batteries on both of them. And I'll just be running them to see what we think. Stay tuned then. Tap Boy 1000.